Hey you guys, welcome back to Sodbusters Metal Detecting. Hey, I got a new permission and uh, here at this church. I don't know uh, when the church was built, but um, I know that this is older ground here and this is an older church, although it has been updated over the years. Um, and so I, I, I asked permission and was granted permission by the church council. And we're going to just see what's in the ground here, you guys. So stick with me and let's see if we can uh, pull up some good treasure. All right, I'll see you on the first good target. It's a beautiful day you guys we got overcast it was raining last night so it's nice and cool um, it'll actually be nice to be wearing the headphones help keep the ears a little bit warm but it's actually fairly comfortable out here so um, I'm excited to get started got a 26 27 25 about six inches deep Okay, we got it out of the hole. Now it's a 28, 29. Let's see what that is. Oh, look at there, there's a coin. Right here. I think that's silver too. Let's take a look. You guys, I don't have a water bottle. Oh, wait a minute. There is a little bit of water in here. I forgot to fill that up. Yep, we got silver. So, 1959, okay? Just a Roosevelt time, but it's silver. We'll take that every day, won't we? 29.30 at four inches. It's probably gonna be a tough dig here. It's right next to the road. Oh, it ain't, ain't as bad as I thought. It is compact gravel. Oh, I got it in the plug. That was pretty good. Kind of expecting a quarter, but I don't expect it to be an old one. We'll see. We will see. You just never know. That's the thing about metal detecting. Oh, there is a quarter. So it's not silver though. So just what I expected. Just a clad quarter. We'll take it. A solid 17. got us a golden pin you guys look at there well the writing's on the wall now fancy golden pin <laughs> all right you guys I did not get this on a live dig but I'm pretty sure that's gonna be a Washington state tax token just an aluminum token find these pretty often and I'm just about positive that's what that is so 
Let's keep on hunting. We'll get that cleaned up a little bit later. We'll try to anyway. These don't clean up very well most of the time. So, all right, let's keep hunting. Oh, hey you guys, take a look at here. Sorry about that. Look at this. That looks like a Boy Scout. Oh man, I think I hit it too. A Boy Scout bolo tie clip. Doggone it, I, I scuffed it. But that's a pretty neat find right there. Get the dirt out of it here so we can take a look at it. I think I got it. There we go. Pretty neat find. We'll take that. Twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, four inches deep. Oh, you guys, look, there's another one. This one's in better shape. So, the Boy Scouts must have taken place here at some point. This is a different style. Look at that. Get these cleaned up and take a look at them. All right. Twenty four to twenty seven is what I'm getting here. Four to six inches. Guys, you're not going to believe this. <laughs> Look at this. Another Boy Scout bolo tie. Look at that. That's number three I found of these. Three of these. That's probably all I've ever found in my life. 23, 24 at four inches. Let's take a look. Take a look at this. Can you believe this? That is number four. That is number four. Look at that. I wonder why there's so many of these badges just left here. I wonder what happened or why the kids just didn't care about them. And that's really weird. That's four of them today.
Hi. Got a really faint, deep signal here, but it's got a high tone in it. It says eight or 10 inches deep. I don't think it'll be that deep, but this could be a good target. Yeah, here we go you guys look at there that is a wheat scent I'll have to clean it up to get a year on it look at the imprint real high tone but it's bouncy worth a dig. It's deep. Let's see what we got. Definitely a deep target. Got a deep hole going here. All right. Oh, I found all oh, you guys. You guys, take a look at this. What in the world is that? I see design on that. What in the world is, I see a star. You guys, what is that? Holy cow, oh, that's beautiful. Oh man. What in the world is that? You guys, look at that. Look at the colors here. Let me run a brush over it real quick get back to you this is and that's sturdy i don't know what kind of metal this is but wow this is really neat let me brush it up real quick you guys i don't know where i lost my toothbrush <laughs> but i'm not able to get this cleaned up yet but i will get some pictures after i get it cleaned up that's that's heavy metal i don't know what it went to i'm gonna have to research this but look how big that is it looks like I probably hit it. I hate that, but um, I don't know how much damage it caused if I did hit it, but that is a big, I see writing on the back here, probably the imprint from the front, but we're gonna research this and see what, what that is. I'm trying to get you guys to, there you go, that's a little bit better. That is really neat. So we'll get it cleaned up. So we got a solid 26 at four inches. By the way, this church was built in 1949. I just found that out. Man, 
Yeah, that's dry and hard ground. Sorry about that, you guys. Making noise for you. This ground is just ridiculous. All right. Oh, here it is. Ah, guys, look at this. <laughs> this one's gold plated. It look, well, it's not gold plated. It's probably brass. But that's number five. Can you believe that, you guys? Look at that. Five of these today. You think there was a Boy Scout event here? <laughs> wait to clean these up and see how they turn out. That's a nice one. 